That thread, I think it starts with a seed. It was a seed that was planted early of storytelling. Mm -hmm. And um, I wanted to allow that seed to ferment, to grow. Um, and I, I kept a promise to myself that when I retired, I was going to get back into what I was passionate prior to playing football, and that was the arts. And, you know, growing up, I was drawing all the time and things like that. And uh, I've always been known as a storyteller. You know, my teammates know me as the storyteller. So um, when I retired, I, I wanted to learn it. So I went to film school, you know, really harnessed the art of script writing and storytelling and learned directing and um, shot some shorts. When I Was King was my first one. It was a comedy that I wrote, whatever, whatever. It's on iTunes, check it out. But <laughs> <laughs> it was, you know, it was, but, it, but at those points I knew that I could direct a film. And I knew it, I knew I, now it was just the fact of having the confidence of following through, to, uh, of, of bringing it to flourishion. And um, we wrote the script. My, my partner, John, myself and John Nadello, we wrote the script. And, I believed in the script, and I'm saying we have something. And from there, it was now you know script development. We developed it and put it in pre-production, and ran into this young lady right here. The typical director has sends out a cast to agents, and mm -hmm. my manager at the time got me an audition for this. I mean, at first it was what two self tapes I think I sent in, mm -hmm. and I was like, I'm such a perfectionist, so you know I've filmed them like five thousand times, like had my room adjusted with whatever lighting, and then you finally get called into the room, which already adds so much like anxiety but pride because you're close but you're not there yet. And then I did I don't know how many chemistry reads, and then waited and waited, and I thought, oh, they th I guess they went with someone else. Whatever, I didn't care that much, and then I got the call. I was like. Oh, I knew it. I'm Reagan. I'm Reagan. No one can do for her what I can do for her. You know. That is true. <laughs> that, that is true. <laughs> I'm a so I'm, I was a soccer player. There you go. But like my whole life, I'm okay. a big athlete, like black belt and karate. Um, I used to do track, so I was super excited to actually have an acting opportunity where I could utilize that because it's so much of it is sports and art are so separate. Um, but I did not jump off the cliff. I did everything else but that dangerous cliff <laughs> jump. I wanted to live post movie and have this interview with you. <laughs> they uh, got a professional for that, okay. which was cool to see how they made a whole other person look exactly like me. Yeah. That's true. That was pretty tight. Which yeah. she looked nothing like you. <laughs> no, looked like they didn't. She had blonde hair. Mm -hmm. The fun is, I think the passion comes from what people get out of it. Mm -hmm. The fact that you experience what she experiences in the film, you watch this film, you're gonna feel exhausted if you really, if you get into this film, you're gonna feel what you run with her. You feel with her, you breathe with her, you're scared with her. I mean, you really, really go on this journey with this character. And, I, and it's an experience. You can watch this film, but you, I think this film is more of an experience. You experience this film. And I think that in the essence of shooting a film, any filmmaker wants, I think, the people to get the experience of the movie. And this is something that you truly, truly have to be prepared for. You can't just go in this film and just like, like, I'm about to watch a normal, lesser days of a film. You might start, because we start off and we, we, we slowly get you into it, you know, setting up story. But once you, once you get started, this film just grabs you and doesn't let you go. Mm -hmm. And uh, the anxiety that people oftentimes, the anxiety they feel with this film, they're like, wow, this, it makes you feel. So those of you that go watch this film, be prepared to go on a ride, because it's a roller coaster. Mm -hmm. This young lady right here, <laughs> this young lady right here is gonna be, in, in, in my mind, she is gonna be the new face of Hollywood. You know, her face now, you see it in all the big Marvel films and comic films like that, this is where she's headed. She, this is a great, great platform for her and what she was able to accomplish. <laughs>